Hi, I'm Cassie Lomas and I'm a makeup artist. I've been doing makeup now for 15 years and I've worked with everyone from Lady Gaga to Rebecca Ferguson. Today I'm going to be making over Binky from Made in Chelsea and we're going to be doing the natural look. Yes. Do you often wear the natural look? Um, try not to, okay. but we talked about earlier, if we go to the gym, yeah. Um, you, I tend to have this kind of cover up going on. A bit of a fresh look, yeah, but still but there's, something there. Yeah, yeah I mean, there's, if there's fitties in the gym, you can't go totally natural, obviously, because that's just embarrassing. You can't go with nothing on the skin no. at all. So we're going to show you how to get a natural look with makeup, so it looks like you haven't got any makeup on, and you can get away with it in yeah, the gym. Yeah, get away with it, yeah. Okay. I'm going to start with the Daniel Sandler Foundation. This, is, this is a radiant foundation, so it gives a really nice luminosity to the skin. And also, a great thing about it is it has a concealer in the top. I so, really want this. Once you've applied your base, you can just go over any areas where you need to with the concealer. And the good thing is that you know it's going to be the right colour for you because you've already got your base colour correct. The best place as well to try your foundation when you're testing out the colour is always on the front panel of your face. Which is where? Which is either your nose or right at the front of your chin. Because people tend to try it on the back of the hands or on the jaw. Yeah. And actually you can't see whether that's the right colour or not. So always try it on the front of your face and make sure it matches into your chest. Yeah. Because you want this whole area. Yeah, you don't have any like colour. orange line going down yes, here, which exactly. I see in quite a few girls. Just going to point out to rub it in. Although we're doing the natural look, we don't want completely nothing on the eyes. So I'm going to be using the Stiller Smudge Pot. And you can just use your finger to blend a little bit of this cream shadow over the eyes. It's got a nice gleam to it as well, so it's going to pick up the light, look really sparkly and make you look wide-eyed and fresh. That's what we need. Even though you're sweating in the gym, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> sweating, glowing in the gym. Glowing Girls in the gym. Girls don't sweat. No. You want to really open up your eyes with lots and lots of mascara and I'm using the Clarins Wonder Perfect Mascara. You can get away with a couple of coats of this mascara, just make sure that you comb your lashes through well in between each coat. Okay, look up for me please. So you can see we're really making a feature out of the eyes by just putting on lots and lots of mascara. Okay, gorgeous eyes. <laughs> like you haven't got any makeup at all. <laughs> okay. So we want a little bit of a healthy flush to the cheeks. I'm using the Daniel Sandler watercolour blush. Now this is a liquid blush. Oh, I've never seen so this I'm before. just going to put it on the back of my hand and I'm going to use my finger. And just smile for me. And you just apply over the apples of the cheeks where you want that really nice pink flush. The great thing about this product is it stays on all day. I'm a huge fan of this. I've never used blusher. It's quite good <gasps> to see what it's like. I, don't, <gasps> I use bronzer. I never use blusher. I'll let you off if you use bronzer. So oh, you don't I have use to nothing. Use, no, 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 no. I use a lot of bronzer. A good tip as well for this is to just put a little bit on the nose. top of your nose and it's almost like you've been sunburned. That it's a cutesy a lot. look. And then to finish this look, we're just going to do lips. Now you don't want to go overboard again, so just choose a nice lip gloss with a rosy tint to it. This is Daniel Sandler Super Gloss. And if you apply it to your lips, and then pat your lips together, just to take off any excess. And you are ready for the gym. I am ready for the gym. Yes. Oh my god. Looking fresh and gorgeous and dewy, not sweaty. It's quite an, quite an old school look, isn't it? Not too much eyeshadow, no, no eyeshadow really. Yeah, and I think and nice rosy lips. Yeah, it's great to just pick out features. So you're picking out the lashes, the cheeks, yeah. and the lips, and, and that's really all you need. Yeah. Perfect. 